All right, starting another day in Las Vegas, still spending the day at Aria. So I think I'm going to go down to the pool. Yesterday was a disappointing disappointment, guys. I only had two beers all day. Um, the day before, hanging out with Beer Store Dude and Lee in the morning. We smashed a lot of beers by noon or so. And when we got back at it at night, it just went off the rails. So, uh, yeah, uh, yesterday I only had two beers all day. And uh, one room beer and one at um, Oyo. So, not so good. But today... I'm already on my third breakfast beer in the room. I did some editing of the videos. And now I'm ready to head downstairs and get at it. So, let's get this day going, boys. Just left the room. Going to actually... Double check the door. Yeah, we're good. So uh, I'm heading over to the Cosmo, meeting up with Blair. Uh, I'm not sure who else is going to go with us, but we're going to do a little road trip. So uh, we'll see where he wants to go, but I'm up for doing some exploring. I believe there used to be a Starbucks over there. Obviously, that's gone. Something new coming in. We have reached the Cosmo, so now we just gotta track down this Blair G guy. All right, we are getting close now. On the left is Buffalo Bills, looks like. We got Whiskey Beats is on the right. Kino said that place is trash, but uh, and what was the other one called? Cream? Cream Valley Ridge. Oh, okay. Super busy over here, guys. A lot, lot going on. Yeah, Blair was just pointing out how packed the parking lot is. <laughs> is it even open? <laughs> we'll find out. Oh, it's open. That's a good sign. We were worried. Yeah, because he knows it's supposed to be 24 hours, right? <laughs> Remember where we parked? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Buffalo Bills looks like it's probably the nicest of the three, I'm guessing. Thank you. Oh, it's dark in here. Nice. Texas tea. <laughs> right there. Oh, right there. I guess we'll do a lap. Yeah, yeah, sure, why not? So the car is at Buffalo. Oh, okay. So Google well, line. We won't tell Kino he was right. No. That would just make things worse. Yeah. Yeah, this place is dead. I don't know if I've been in a casino this dead since COVID. I know. Like... Sign up for the players club. Oh my god. <laughs> well, you know what? Somewhere there's a, an outlet mall that used to be around here. And pretty much all the stores left. Are oh yeah. This is just sad. On Saturday, September 30th, enjoy an event of his, including Shelly, December. Oh, my host is in Anna's office right now. <laughs> you think that's the mall down there? Maybe, but that might be connected up with the other mall, but everything's kind of gone. Yeah, okay. I guess this explains why the parking lot was empty. Yeah. Yeah. Once when I went to Eastside Canaries, this was before COVID, it was pretty dead, yeah. but it even had more people in it than this. Like, the only person I've run into is the security guy. Wow. See, they used to have a lot of 
used to have a monorail that went across the highway to Whiskey Peaks. Oh, really? This is monorail there, but okay. that, that's not going. They've got a Zoltar over there. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. The most racist slot machine in the world. Mr. Lucky Fortune Cookie. No MSG. <laughs> what the fuck? Wow. God's old tower, as Blair was pointing out over here. Wow, this place is interesting, dude. Yeah. Okay. Well, they still managed to have a sports book over there. Oh, William Hill. Yeah. Okay. Alright, well, yeah, this is fun. Yeah. <laughs> Spider-Man game. Oh. A lot of different slots I haven't seen. Well, that is kind of neat, actually. Yeah. I haven't seen that Spider-Man game in Vegas, have you? No. A no. few minutes later. Here's this was the monorail track. Blair just pointed out to me. That's kind of cool. wonder how long that's been gone for. I'm not sure. Be a while. Yeah. Start to warm up. Good stuff. Prim Valley Casino Resort. So these are all owned by the same people. Okay. Collective Souls coming here. Wow. where your careers go to die. <laughs> I like the theming in here already. Yeah, it's very cool, isn't it? Yeah. Old West. And it's quite a bit busier in here. Yeah. Just a tree standing in the middle of the uh, casino floor. Oh, nice. You want to head down there? Or? Sure, if we can do that. Yeah. Uh, it was on one of the old reasons. Oh, so we're good. It's back. Yeah. Uh, Another Texas tea over here. Yeah. Mexican food. Oh, man. Here it is. Oh, they have their own slot machines, too. That is so cool. Bonnie and Clyde. Wow, look at the bullet holes in it. All right, you ready? Yeah. This was cool. If this casino was in Vegas, it would do well. Oh, yeah. 
really cool feeling. Yeah. I guess that's the arena where they have the big concerts down there. So, okay. Well, some concerts. I don't know if they're big or not. <laughs> What's that? I think we're totally lost. We, we came in over there. But oh, did we? I'm seeing if there's... This looks like there might be an area that they have the long ride track. Oh, this was the log ride. Yeah, well, it's all drained now, obviously. But, uh... Wow, that's cool. Mandel O. So Kino said this place was trash, so we felt like we had to check it out, eh, Blair? Exactly. Have to investigate. Yes. It's definitely busier than the first casino we hit. There's more cars in the parking lot. Yep. Well, that looks like it's in good shape. Yep, that's a good sign. Wow. Well, the air works good in here. Well, there's, there's people in here, so that's something. Yep. I think I literally hear crickets, though. <laughs> <laughs> I can hear that, too, dude. <laughs> Oh my god. I don't know, I think it's still slightly better than the first one. It may be. But, yeah, Just Kino. because it has people in it. Yeah, but yeah, Kino was correct. Yeah. Can you still hear crickets? He's over by the bar. <laughs> god. Yeah, this is really not much here, is no, it? No, it's just it's smaller for sure. Oh, okay, so it says catch, catch a wave. Hmm. I don't know if I see that before. Yeah. Well, you got an IHOP, that's a bad Yeah. All right. All right, another quick stop. <laughs> On to the next one. Drive through. <laughs> all the gas pumps. How many did you say were here? Like a hundred? Ninety-six. So yeah, ninety-six. Basically a hundred. Oh, nice. A Skittles vending machine. Can't believe we found PJ. <laughs>
plane up there, what the hell? <laughs> a beer cave. Well, it cool, cool down. Yeah. I wonder if it's cheaper. It's not bad. White Castle is a hopping player. It is. Ultimate Coca Cola. Hmm. What does that mean? <laughs> I have no idea. Alright guys, so we were just talking and Blair's bringing me over to this Magic Mountain, right? Is it called Magic Mountain? Seven Magic Mountains. Yeah. Seven Magic Mountains. And uh, it's very impressive. <laughs> no, not really. But uh, Blair, why did you decide to bring me over here? Because who doesn't want to see rocks piled upon each other painted different colors? I mean, it's a must see. <laughs> you couldn't miss it. And yet there's so many people out here in this heat. What is wrong with these people? <laughs> oh, and the other thing is when we were at the gas station, you seen a woman, right, with a case of White Castle. She had, it was a box full of White Castle. That's just a bad idea. Hey, look at all these people. And this isn't, I think it's much busier than this too. There, there it is. Wow. <laughs> I think I'm good from here. I'll take a picture from here. Yeah, me too. I like the air conditioning. There you go. Got an ocean plate. Hey. He's back there. Yep. Got my everywhere player. Hey guys. <laughs> and we're going to uh, Water Street Casinos. So uh, this should be interesting. Where do you think you want to eat? Any idea? No? No idea. Oh, I see the panels. Oh, yeah. This is cool. It just kind of appeared out of nowhere.
Thank you. All right, we are here at the Rainbow Club. It's part of the uh, casinos here on uh, Water Street. And yeah, so just uh, bellied up to the bar, playing some uh, quarter kino, and yeah, having a good time. The drinks are a flowing, and uh, very friendly staff here. Very cool. I like this place a lot. One of the managers approached me, asked me if I was an influencer. <laughs> Not quite, but uh, very nice reception we received when we arrived at this casino. This restaurant is called Triple B, and uh, it's in the uh, Rainbow Casino. Very good. I grabbed the mozzarella sticks, and guys, check out this cheese pull I had. This is a pretty epic one right here. What's going on, Wade? Come on, finish your plate. I can't do it. Be a big boy. Ocean's finishing his. Oh, yeah. I should have got that. We are now taking the walk from uh, Rainbow Club over here to Emerald Island. It's a uh, very cool, unique uh, casino inside. Um, and yeah, so uh, this is our third. We've already hit up, as I mentioned, the Rainbow Club. And we also hit up the pass. We really didn't do much in uh, the pass. We really just walked around, checked it out. And then uh, we decided to uh, head on over to the Rainbow Club. So uh, here we are at Emerald Island. We're just going to take a quick look around before heading back to the Strip. All right, guys, that was a really fun morning slash afternoon hanging out with Blair, hitting up all those casinos, and then meeting up again with uh, Lee and Daniel Ocean and heading over to uh, the Water Street casinos. Uh, lots of fun. Like I said, the Rainbow Casino is definitely the best one of the three over there. We had a lot of fun there. So uh, heading back to the room, going to rust a little and charge the phone before heading over to Ellis Island for tonight's group call. I'm down to my last room beer, so I'm going to grab this, and I'm going to head over to the Horseshoe, meet up with Lee for a little bit, and then make my way to Ellis Island for tonight's group call. This is Guy Ferrari's Flavor Town, new uh, restaurant here between Paris and the Horseshoe. And yeah, we'll definitely be hitting this up in December during our New Year's trip with Liz. She loves Guy. All right, guys, over here at the uh, Caesar Rewards kiosk. Okay, promotions, I guess. Please touch a promotion. 50% off Dawson, Donny Osmond. Um, two anytime tickets. All right, so there's my ticket. It's two free anytime tickets. Very nice. Leaving the horseshoe now and heading on over to Ellis Island. This is about a 10 minute walk.
All right, guys, here we are at the Ellis Island entrance. We are just going to make our way inside. And I have a uh, group slot pull going on today here. So uh, we're going to head on in and find a machine. Not 100% sure which machine we're playing yet, but uh, we'll figure that all out and wait for everyone to arrive. Should be a good time. So let's get at it. I'm just loading some money in. How about you show some of the players? Oh, okay. So I'm filming. It's me. Hi, guys. Um, I'm filming. So we got Don over here. Oh, hi. I don't know anybody's name. And Blair and... Yeah, and David. Okay. Got um, Oceans over here. Rampart. Lee. Oh, hi. <laughs> Denise is here. Somewhere is Destiny. Woo! Oh, man. This lucky bitch right here. <laughs> oh, what do we do? Hi, Lorraine. What do we pick? Um, I, I think this one, that's the one where you have the slots and you okay. hit things. Let's do it. Watch. You got the bonus because that's the clown bonus. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. Is that my fault? Yes, that was me. Yes, it was. Oh, I'm good. Okay, let me go back, guys. You're gonna have to press the button. You have to push him, dude. You have to get him. No. No, no, no. You have to push that and press it. There. Oh. That's fine. Oh, oh. Balance it out. Okay. You have to push it when you think it's going to go in the thing. Okay. You want 25 times. Go. Push it, go. Oh, oh, oh five. All right. We want 25. Oh, 
So we started at 7.50 and we finished at 6.20. Uh, not too bad. It's not too bad. Better than mine. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, we're done for the run? Yeah, we're done. One, two, three, four. 15 people. Okay, so we ended. Everybody gets 41 bucks. <laughs> well, you got to save pennies. It could have been worse. Please, thumbs up. Over here at the Ellis Island Cafe, grab the wings for 14 bucks. I think they've gone up in price, but still really good. Times have you been on this? This might be my third or fourth. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. What about you? What's up? How many times have you been on this? Oh, uh, this is probably my sixth or seventh. <laughs> Here we go. I'm finally on the high roller slash low roller. And uh, no, this is definitely the high roller. There you see Liam Blair. I'm also on this with uh, the big man, Daniel Ocean, and Cinnamon, and her son, Nick. Lots of great views up here. Over here, you see Harris. You see the Mirage. Very nice. Very nice indeed. And, uh, yeah, the uh, group slot poll, eh, we didn't make much money. Actually, we didn't make any money, but everyone was only down nine bucks. So, uh, hey, I consider that a win. We had a good time. That's the main thing. All right, guys, on the high roller, and we'll be back. Right, we're over here at Paris, and it's time for, you got it, the Budweiser of the day. Budweiser of the day, guys. Cheers. That's a wrap for day four in Las Vegas. Busy, busy day. Blair and I went out to those uh, casinos down by uh, the California border. That was a lot of fun. Met up with Lee and uh, Ocean and hit the uh, Water Street casinos. Again, lots of fun. We really, really enjoyed the uh, Rainbow Casino. That was our favorite. And uh, then last night we did the uh, group pull and... Um, that was fun as well, but we didn't quite win what we wanted to win, but everyone was only down nine bucks, so you can't complain too much. Um, the high roller was lots of fun, and uh, then after that, we uh, left the guys. They went to uh, Carnival Court, and uh, Lee and I headed back to our rooms, and 
that's it. That's today. So we'll talk to y'all again tomorrow. Later, guys.